Hey everybody, welcome to episode 26 of Crack TV, during which I will be consuming this entire KFC family meal. I'm your host, Droid Mike, excuse me. Still counts. That is from being drunk, not the food. I'm your host, Droid Michael Swain, the suave stud with absolutely impeccable manners. I'm sorry? No. Just in my mouth. We're good. With me, as always, is my co-host, clips of people vomiting. No! Why? That was just a terrible choice. According to my internal heart monitor, my valves are either clogged with pure giblet grease, or today's topic is the eight most hideous foods condoned by society. Get ready to get hungry. Then less hungry. Then gotten to queasy. Actually, can we not do this? By now, you've probably heard that Japanese Burger Kings are offering a seven patty Whopper in honor of the release of Windows 7. It's a tower of beef so huge, you could fit an entire fetus inside it. To put that in perspective, most McDonald's burgers only contain about a third of a fetus. Not to be outdone, Ronald McDonald personally killed three animals and a fry guy to bring you the McDonald's Mega Tomato Big Mac Breakfast Burger. A sandwich for people who aren't sure whether they want breakfast or lunch, but are positive they want a myocardial infarction. Once again, this burger only available in Japan because apparently Japan won't rest until they've beaten us at everything that we're good at. Up next, school shootings. Damn you, Japan! That one was ours! Well, I cover this chicken leg with chocolate sauce, you're gonna watch a montage of giant burgers. Naturally, you got your king burger. This one is garnished with a burger, making it the world's first meta burger. The Japanese one features a hot slab of meat between two black buns. I believe they call it the Michael Swain. This burger is so large, if you finish it, you get legal guardianship of these three children. Welcome to the Heart Attack Grill, where a combo meal includes a burger soaked in pig fat, French fries, Jolt Energy Cola, and a carton of unfiltered cigarettes. Over 350 pounds? Eat free, then have Nurse Mary wheel you to your car in a wheelchair. Then go home, lift up your gut so you can fondle yourself, and contemplate suicide. It's just another Friday night at the grill! Okay, so far, we've been exploring what nutritionists like to call the killing foods. Let's move to a different part of the pyramid I like to call status foods. These foods are less pizza on top of a pizza and more pizza that you could never afford in your life. Like the 007 Pizza Royale, a pizza topped with caviar soaked in champagne and 24 karat gold. But I know what you're thinking. What kind of champagne is that caviar soaked in? Champagne with gold in it, duh. Top your slice off with some gold marmalade and you're good to go. And to ensure that your crap comes out creamy and sparkly, make sure you wash it all down with some gold flake eggnog. Because yeah, there's a huge overlap between people who love eggnog and people who want gold in their food. A cake covered in diamonds? You know, I think it would have been cheaper to just round up all the poor people and fuck them in the ass. And a fruitcake? It's not even a good kind of cake. Oh, wow. A uh, diamond fruitcake. Huh. Didn't we get you one of those last year? Oh, yeah. I guess you did. Well, this is a different one. Uh-huh. Are you going to try it? Will it rip up my insides? Probably. Then, no. Probably not right away. Smart. Oh, oh God. Why is it black? You know, folks, eating all this chicken reminds me of an old folk tale about the two hens that double teamed a pig and then fell into a deep fryer. The result? The KFC Double Down. A sandwich that proves that a bowl is not, in fact, the most depressing way to serve fried chicken. The sandwich is two strips of bacon, two slices of cheese, a dollop of kernel sauce, all nestled between two chicken breast patties. Which, when you think about it, isn't a sandwich so much as a wad. Also, I shudder to think what kind of sauce comes out of a kernel. Since they only serve the double down in the south, and I'm not allowed back there, 
I decided to recreate it with two chicken breasts, some bubble tape, and gravy. Mmm. You can really taste the bones. Okay. That last thing, but inside a donut. It's called a Krispy Kreme chicken donut. And you can get, actually, no. You know what? I'm not going to tell you where you can get it. Because it shouldn't exist. A jelly donut plus fried chicken plus honey does not equal food. And if it does, then I'm officially announcing the premiere of Michael's Chicken Bucket Supreme. There you go. $29.99. Knock yourself the fuck out. I hope you choke. Hey, ah. Listen, I'm sorry about that, guys. I'm just a little... Okay, you know what? I'm actually not gonna go to uh, Clippy this time because... Ah! Oh, God. Okay. More? There's... We found a lot of those. Oh, my God. I've been Michael Swain. Here's music. I will fuck you up, Clippy. I am serious. You are dead to me. I've decided to recreate it with two pieces of chicken, some bubble tape, and gravy. Wow. <laughs> you can... <laughs> you can really taste... <laughs> this is the worst thing I've ever done. <laughs>